Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Minecraft Bedrock Edition video guys. Today, I'm going to be showing you how you can use a PS4 controller to play Minecraft Bedrock Edition on your Windows 10 PC. So if you guys are interested in finding out how to use a PS4 controller, make sure you stay right here. Alright guys, before we get into the tutorial, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video with all your friends if this video does end up helping you. But anyways, with that, let's start with the tutorial. So first thing guys, we're going to discuss what you're going to need in order to play uh, Minecraft on your Windows 10 with a PS4 controller. So obviously, the white elephant in the roof, you will need a PS4 controller. Now, it doesn't matter which type of PS4 controller you have, whether you have a newer model or an older model, it does not matter, as long as you have a PS4 controller. Now, what you need is obviously a copy of Minecraft Windows 10 Edition, which is probably, no duh, but you're still going to need a licensed copy. Of course, if you find a way to, uh, you know, get an illegal copy, it, it should still work, but that's completely up to you. We always recommend going for the legitimate version of Minecraft. Then finally, guys, what you're going to need is a micro USB to USB cord or cable. Now most controllers will normally come with something like this and I'm sure if you look around your house you should be able to find one but if not in case you do not have one just go ahead and buy yourself a micro USB to USB cable. Now what you guys are going to need to do is once you have all the components what you're going to need to do firstly is grab your USB cable and get the micro USB end and stick it into your PS4 controller into the micro USB slot on your PS4 controller. Then you get the other end of the cord which will be the USB cord and you stick it into your PC in any of the USB ports. Once you have that, all you'll need to do is launch up Minecraft and you should be good to go. Then to test it, all you guys need to do is go obviously in the game, move your analog stick with the controller and if you see it corresponding on the screen in the game, for instance going up and down, you do know that your controller is working. Now another little tip that we would like to give you guys is that when you use a controller for the first time on Windows 10 Edition with your PS4 controller, you're going to get these annoying things called uh, tool tips or controller tips which pop up on your screen to give you tips on how to play Minecraft with the controller. Now obviously if this is your first time using a controller to play Minecraft, this would be a great thing and we'd recommend not disabling it. However, if you're a veteran to the game, this may actually irritate you, so I'm going to show you how to disable it. So what you're going to need to do is go into the settings of your Minecraft. Minecraft game, go over here and you will eventually see that there is a setting that says disable tool tip. Then what you're going to need to do is just disable that and then you will no longer get those irritating uh, tool tips that, you know, no one really wants. Of course, if you have any problems, comment down below and we'll try our best to help you out. So once again, just to go through it all, you will need a PS4 controller of any model, a USB to micro USB cord, and of course a version of Minecraft Windows 10 Edition for your PC. With all that, you will be able to use a PS4 controller on Minecraft Windows 10 Edition for your PC. Anyway guys, that is going to wrap up today's video. If this video did help you out, once again, be sure to be, leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and share this with all your friends. It really does help and really means a lot to us if you could do that for us. But anyway, that is that. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope this did help you out. With that, enjoy using your PS4 controller on Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. And until next time, we'll see you in another video. Peace out.